Hey, what's up, ladies and gentlemen? This is Ryan, a.k.a. London Hawthorne. You've probably watched a few episodes previously, but if you're not sure what this is, this is putting it all out there. Uh, this is my weight loss journey, and I'm going to document it every day. This is the fourth day that I've been doing this uh, vlog, blog, video blog, whatever you want to call it. And I'm literally just putting it all out there. I'm telling you what I did, what I didn't do, um, whether or not I go to the gym or not, I'm going to tell you what I did. If I ate marshmallow, if I ate a chicken breast, I'm not going to lie. I'm going to put it all out there. If I go to Speedway and I get a 44 ounce Icy, Speedy, Freeze, whatever they're called, I'm going to let you know. Because there's going to be days where I'm going to do that and uh, probably Saturday, to be honest with you, I'm going to get a Speedy Freeze. But I'm going to try my best to, you know, get fit get a little less fat, and hopefully in some way inspire other people. Uh, if, if, the, if you haven't watched the other videos, a brief little synopsis is, uh, I've, at one time, I lost over 200 pounds, and I've been fluctuating back and forth, and I gained it back, and this is my journey, losing it again for the last time, because I will never, and the rock means never, put it back on again. Uh, it's it's never going to be put back on when I lose it this time, and that's a solemn promise. Um, so anyway, um, here is my scale. I'm currently too fat for my scale, but I'm going to turn it on, and I'm going to try my best. It is a big goal of mine. You hear that creaking? Oh yeah, that's not a good sign. As you can see, it says E going to re-zero out. Let's try it again. Alright, so I'm still too fat for my scale. Uh, I'm, I'm going to let you know my scale goes up to 400 pounds, so that means I am over 400 pounds. Last time I got weighed a couple months ago, I was 431, and uh, I've been trying really hard. I joined a gym called Anytime Fitness. It's the second gym I'm a part of. I'm not going to mention the other gym because they're haters. But uh, Anytime is a really nice gym. I enjoy it. Um, if you're going to join that gym, please uh, message me. And uh, you, know, you can use me as a referrer and you get a discount too. Uh, I'm not being sponsored by Anytime, but I'd like to be sponsored. Uh, I go to the one in uh, my hometown. But I'd like to check out other Anytime Fitnesses. Um, uh, I really want to incorporate more boxing into my workout routine. But unfortunately, my my Anytime Fitness doesn't have a punching bag. I hear the one in uh, Mishawaka, Indiana. By the way, I'm from South Bend, Indiana. Home of Notre Dame, if you're not familiar with that. Uh, the one in Mishawaka, which is about 25 minutes away, uh, I hear has a punching bag. So I might try and check over there. But anyway... Uh, Today was our store inventory. Uh, I work retail. My my first job, I work retail. And uh, it's our big store inventory. is a cluster, you know what. But uh, so for breakfast, I uh, at about 6 a.m., I had a granola bar and a banana. At about 9.15, I had another banana and I had two cheese sticks. I don't mean the deep fried delicious ones. I mean the little rectangle thingamajigs. Uh, had a jalapeno one and a Colby Jack in case you wanted to know. For lunch, they actually treated us and they gave us these little deli subs. So I had three little two inch sub things and I had some cookies. I really wish I didn't eat the cookies because they were not that good. I had a Diet Mountain Dew, uh, 12 ounce can. Um, I'm not lying to anybody. That's what I had. I also had some chips. I ate way too many chips. I didn't need them and I regret eating the chips. Um, I'm not perfect, folks, as you can tell. Um, then anyway, here's, here's what I am proud of. I went to the gym afterwards, and, uh, I got 80 minutes on the elliptical, uh, on average between 140, 150 calories, uh, each, each, uh, 20 minute session, um, according to that elliptical, uh, drawing a blank at what the name of the elliptical is, but, uh, Different ellipticals are different, you know. 
this Anytime Fitness has four of the same. I'll, I'll make it a point to see what brand it is. But when I used to go to my other gym, which I'm a member of, uh, there was a pre-core model, and I would get 300 to 330 per 20 minute session. So who really knows? Um, I need to up the intensity for sure, but my knees are just throbbing as you can tell. As you can probably assume from being a big guy and being on my feet at a retail job, it's tough. Plus I'll be picking up another job very soon, I think, and uh, so that's tough right there. But I'm going to make it a point to keep going, keep going, keep going to the gym and try and get some of this off as soon as possible in a healthy manner. And I freaking meant to bring my supplements in here to show you what I take, but I take No Explode 2. Uh, I have this extra one here, um, lemon lime flavor. And I got these like NOS. Uh, it's supposed to be, uh, I got these things for like 10 or 15 bucks at uh, Walmart. Uh, it's like 10 or 15 dollars and it's supposed to be like a increased blood flow and make your supplements uh, run smoother. I don't know, it's probably just a water pill or something. But dang it, I'm going to try my best to have it in the next video tomorrow. Um, so please check it out. This, uh, I'm going to make it a, a big conscious effort to go tomorrow to the gym and maybe Friday. Saturday it's not going to happen because I have to work and then I'm going to Fort Wayne, Indiana for a WWE live event taping. Ooh, ooh. Uh, so I will not, definitely not going to the gym on Saturday, unfortunately, but I will... Most likely be going Thursday and uh, Friday. And then try my best Sunday, Monday, which are my two days off, to go ham. Mm, ham. But anyway, I appreciate the comments I've been getting. I've, I've gotten some haters, but you know what? Haters fuel me. Just like a 44-ounce Speedy Freeze. I drink a ton of water as well. Um, I, I believe Chris Powell... The famed trainer says a 200-pound man needs to be drinking 200 ounces of water a day. Holy carp on a stick. Uh, I've never, I don't know if I've drank that much before, but uh, if you guys have any recommendations, you know, besides put the fork down <laughs> and uh, get off my butt, which I am, I'm currently not on my butt. And by the way, someone called me a fat ass in my video uh, yesterday. And I got to say, as you can tell, my ass is not that fat. In fact, I'd say it's probably one of my best features. Now, if you had said, like, big gut or fat gut, I'd be like, dude's got a point. You know, the classic joke is that I don't have a six-pack, I have a keg. Well, you know what? It's apropos. Um, so, anyway, I would appreciate if you could uh, leave a comment. Constructive would be the pref preferred one. But if you're going to be a hater... Sipping on that Haterade, watch your calories, because Haterade is a very high caloric beverage. And, uh, you know, leave that comment, preferably positive, like, Way to go! You're cool! Let's be cardio buddies! That would be preferred, but, you know, if not, if you're going to be like, fat ass, or get off the couch, I'm going to be like, I don't have a couch, I have a Barca lounger. Yeah! Okay, thanks a lot for watching. Subscribe to my channel. I do a ton of videos on various subjects. Uh, like I said, I, this is just a work in progress. I'm not perfect. I'm going to eat pizza. I'm going to have steak. I'm going to eat a taco or two or eight. No, not eight. I'm not going to eat eight anymore. I'm a former competitive eater. Uh, can you believe it? And... Uh, you know, it's tough. Portion control is my big thing. You know, I can eat a one slice of pizza and feel okay with myself. It's Eating a whole pizza is probably not bad. So going from a former competitive eater to eating one slice of pizza is very, very tough. So join me and uh, hopefully I can somehow inspire you guys. Uh, please check out my other videos. Subscribe to my channel. Leave a comment, and uh, hey, have a good day. What's your for favorite form of exercise? Do you like disc golf? That's one goal I'd like to do, but I'd probably be out of breath throwing that shit, you know? So uh, leave a comment. Thanks a lot for watching, and uh, haters, gonna hate.
lovers gonna love and friends are gonna comment and like my video